This seems easy enough. I have to drive the car from point A to point B. If I want, I can stop and try to grab the coins along the way, which should be just as easy as it sounds and looks. And we're going to make it look easier eventually. That's okay though, just getting warmed up. All we got to do is collect three coins. That can't really be that hard. Uh... The game is called Oops No Breaks for a reason, because we don't have breaks. Perfect run. I expect the levels are going to get a little bit harder, and we have a much slower car this time. And it goes swimming. Alright, turns out there's probably actually going to be some kind of strategy to this. Uh, with that, that one worked. This car doesn't handle very well, so uh, we're just going to have to kind of make do with what we get, but I think we made it. Not sure I'm going to be able to collect the coins on all of the levels because I feel like it's going to get pretty hard, and I don't even know what I did wrong there. It's not my fault the car is stupid and can't jump the gap. Oh, we missed. And we're in the water anyway. Okay, so we got to try and steer this, I don't know, here. There we are. And we're suddenly going light speed because this car has wonderful top speed, apparently. It's very slow at first, like its acceleration kind of sucks, but then once it gets going, it really gets going. Which definitely makes it a little bit crazy to control. Now look at that last coin. And you gotta remember, we're always racing against a clock too, because um, I'm trying to set records here. Obviously, I'm a professional at whatever these games are. Okay, I'm gonna try and just jump straight over that next gap, but not this one. We're just gonna go into water on that one. What I meant to do was kind of like that, but actually get the coin. So donuts are gonna be my friend in this. Donuts are basically my way of slowing down and controlling myself. So we come up here, we're gonna do a hard turn here, turn, wow. I was so confident and then I was so far off. Okay, this time I'm feeling a little bit more confident. Still really gotta work on my strategy. I did it, I got the coin. I just slid into it. Oh, okay, that's not great. Right, okay, luckily the car is able to kind of right itself very, I'm just panicking now because I finally got the damn coin. And we missed, didn't really expect that to happen. But I'm starting to realize this car does actually turn very sharply if I move the cursor very abruptly, kind of like that. So we got that, now we just gotta not, we're gonna do smaller turns when we're up in that area. I can already feel how stressful this is going to get because I'm on like level three and I can't even hit the stupid flag. Okay, this time I'm going to do it smart and come into the flag sideways. I should have like a blood pressure gauge on my arm when I'm doing games like this just to watch it go up and up and up. I do like this truck a little bit better, like it turns a lot wider, but it's much, much slower and therefore easier to manage, believe it or not. Now we're going on two wheels for some reason, but that's fine because it can swim anyway. How attached are we to the coins? Maybe I'll just employ the tornado technique where we're just mostly going to go in circles a lot. And we're going to use these circles to inch closer to the coins. It's not very... Whoa, okay, we're going up here now. Great. All right, well, we completed the level. That's probably fine. His car looks very fast and it also can't swim. So we're going to try and line ourselves up straight before going over the bumps. Sort of like that. And then I don't really know what I'm doing anymore. Okay, how are we... That was actually really close. That was not. This car is a lot of fun, but it's very hard to control. It turns absolutely very sharp though. And that makes it for an added challenge because every vehicle handles a little bit different. So just as you kind of get used to how to work with one, you have to use a different one. And uh, it's far different from the one before. That was so close that time. I got to kind of control the speed right there. Getting the hang of it though, look at me go. I feel like this one is a very fine point. You either... Well, you don't do that, but you have just enough speed to make the corner or you're going way too fast. Think I don't have it. So a little turn like, uh, we're always so close right there. I get a little hesitant because I don't want to go too far. Okay, I'm now applying the donut technique to this car. It's a little bit hard to do because the car is so fast that it takes off going right away. Missed it. Think I might have done it. So long as I don't screw it up from here, I think we're going to... Where's the end, by the way? Oh, oh no. It's funny because as many times as I tried this, I never considered where the flag was at the end. Okay, I got the third coin again. We're going to go straight forward. I think that's my problem. When I'm going for the flag, I overthink it. I should just put the cursor on it and go for it. Well, this also looks very stressful and we're already stuck in a place we're not supposed to get stuck. Not really sure what I'm supposed to do about this little problem we have. I wasn't even trying to break anything and we're just stuck. I can't get out. Good news though, if you press R, you can actually restart the entire level so we're not as stuck as I thought. This is going to be incredibly stressful though. At least the ramp comes for us right away and we kind of got that part pretty easily figured out. This part. So we got to do this twice basically and we missed the coin anyway so that's fun. Great. And this car's out of control. Okay we're gonna have to get really good at the donut technique with this car. Uh, and we're done. Whoever made this level is an evil evil person and I'm all about it. Okay we got that one. We're coming up to the top. Okay now we just need to try and time this one a little better. So if we go like now maybe. 
we missed the coin again. We're very good at missing that coin. So far, it really just seems like a speed management game. As long as you can control your speed, you're going to be fine. Uh, just don't fall off the edge also. So it's a control your speed, but also don't fall off the edge game. So this time we missed the coin on the ramp uh, suspiciously, but uh, that means we got the coin there. This might actually, this might turn into just make it to the end of the level type game because these coins are getting pretty frustrating to deal with. Not going to go for that. Could we just park against the wall for a sec? We kind of can, but then as we release, we're going to be going super fast. Anyways, got those two for the first time. I have no idea how I'm going to do this. Oh, come on. Climb, car, climb. We go back and forth. You can do it. We might actually be able to bounce off the wall and climb. I'm confident. Uh-oh. We're going to go ahead and scout the rest of this level to see how hard this would be to do. Because I haven't really seen this yet. And like when there's no pressure, I can do that fine. The pressure gets to me. And this is just a death trap of a coin. But we should be able to donut into it. Yeah, when there's no pressure, we do this fine. We'll go straight to the flag. You know what? Let's pretend we got all the coins in 16.3 seconds. This doesn't seem so bad. The truck doesn't corner super well, but it's not that quick, so it's not that stressful. We got that one. We'll go wide around the sign. Idiot, get off the sign. Or maybe we'll just climb right up that way. Never mind. Those wide corners kind of don't make it easy to do much of anything at all. And we didn't make it up the ramp that time. We're so good at this. You'd never know we've already been playing for like 45 minutes. Okay, I got the first coin. We are a little bit out of control, but now we're going to jump up this and then we're going to get a coin that's on the edge. I don't like where that coin is. I don't know if I can get that without getting stuck behind the tree. Or we could just do that and accomplish absolutely nothing. Okay, actually, yeah, I... How am I supposed to get that coin? Like this? Truck, get up there. I've seen you climb things before. Get up there. I got both the coins. And then I suddenly it's not a mountain goat. I'm going to go ahead and say it now. I'm not getting that third coin. It's just that's not going to happen. If I try and do that, you guys won't see a video for four days because I'll spend four days trying to get the damn coin, which actually really pains me right now. I really want that coin. Oh, we actually got it. I decided to just go for it. No, we just carefully got it. You see, I think it's when I take the pressure off of it. It doesn't matter anymore. I'm confused. I'm less confused now. I see what we're supposed to do. We got to go up here. We got to grab that coin over there without going in the water, which seems suspiciously hard, but I think I have an idea. Okay, we came in with less speed that time. I think I'm getting the hang of it. Again, it's going to be a little bit of the donut technique, kind of like that. Then we just got to go slow everywhere we can, except in the water, not the water. I have a bad habit on this one of turning the car the wrong way. Okay, that's sure we'll get a retry on that so we go like this and oh we might have something here that's not enough speed how are you supposed to get all of that speed here can we just oh we can actually go at that full speed this might work then nope that didn't work okay but maybe i can do this full speed and that's kind of a good sign because maybe i could be doing yeah i missed a second boost maybe i could be doing more things full speed in this actually we could probably just go from here but just like less in the water about it but I'm getting the hang of this because that I can kind of go like that. That's going to too far. But if I do this one now and go like that, that should work. Yeah, that works. And then we're going to grab that coin and we got a perfect run. Sizing up the next level, we're going to crash. I thought those would slow us down way more than that. But that's okay because we're employing the donut technique from now on. And it is undefeatable. So we're going to like that. We're going to spin it around the wrong way. Can you climb up for once? That's fine. I'm getting way too confident suddenly. Just for that, I'm going to dive my car straight into the water without crossing a single bridge. Okay, second coin has been collected. So now we're going to go over here. We're going to do a little donut to control our speed. We're going to come over here, do a little donut to control our speed. Got the third coin. I was so focused, I forgot to start recording and I actually hit the thing. I was very stressed out right about here. Uh, Why is it telling us to go that way? There's a coin over here, though. Oh, there's two coins there and then we got to jump back across, maybe. I might have a way to do this. So we take you, we take you, and then we jump. Yep, good enough for me. I don't know where we're going from here. Presumably this way. Spin, spin, spin. Gonna try and... Yeah, that's not gonna work. This level actually doesn't seem as bad as the last few, really. It sounds weird, but there's so much, like, ground to stand on that as long as I can do big, comfortable donuts, like, it's really not that bad. So we'll come down here, and then we're gonna donut a few times. You gotta do really tight donuts, like that missed but never mind okay i got the last coin just now just gotta make it to that flag got it i'm liking these dark colored levels this one seems suspiciously easy i'm a little worried about this why is it so easy this was first try this level was easy i'd imagine it's not going to stay easy for very long though because now we have a quarter pipe we have to deal with so we need to shoot over that way 
and missed. Not really sure, probably right where the boards are maybe? Is that what it's trying to show me? Well, we made it across, so we'll go on up there and find... Never mind. Look where that other coin is. I could probably get that. Gonna donut in, nice and slow. There we go. Now we're gonna get lots of speed to come up here. Doesn't work. Right, well, we're gonna touch the flag for now. Never mind. I thought maybe we could just touch the flag to be like, yeah, there we go. We completed the level at least. Do we have to hit like multiple of these? I, I don't know how to get up there. Okay, I'm getting a little closer. I've just got to come at it from like a way wider angle. <laughs> Not like that though. Like way over here and then you got to, well, that was also really bad. You got to come across like here. You guys taking notes? Good. Oh, that actually worked. So there we go. We'll get that one. We'll get this one. We're going to try and get that last coin. But I'm feeling a little not optimistic about it. We're going to drive over that. We're going to do some donuts. See, I just got to take the pressure off myself right now and go, okay, we can get this without problem. We just got to be nice and controlled about things. Uh-oh. Okay, now we're starting to panic a little bit. Got to get it and we're good. Okay, this one has some moving parts to it. That's fine. That coin's not too bad to get because we're getting the hang of it now. We're going to boost over. I think these are the ones that are going to annoy me more than anything where there's a coin like where you got to time it because it's going to be very annoyingly hard to time these. Because like that one, we got the coin, but we died. This got the coin. Stop, please. Okay, we got very lucky there. I would say that was skill, but it really wasn't. Those are heavier barrels. Well, it makes it hard when I don't know how heavy the things I'm hitting are for the first time. Can we drop down to there? Come on. Never mind. Okay, we got the timing down for the beginning of this level. Uh, oh, actually, here we go. Let's just go for it. Okay, where's the end? There was a trick to the beginning where if you just get the coin right away, you could time it perfectly. Then that worked. This level uh, doesn't actually seem as bad as you might think. We're we're making that look really easy. It's really not that bad. The truck's a little bit odd to control, but there's lots of room to kind of maneuver at least. So we'll take you, we'll jump across, we'll grab you, we'll do a little one of those, then we're going to fall off into the water. That one's going to be a little bit hard to get. Because when you're on a narrow bridge, I can't slow down. The only way I can slow down is by doing a donut. That takes lots of width. I am getting better at the game, though. I approach that bridge a little bit backwards. Come on, we got the coin. We're making progress. Just not really sure how to approach this problem. Maybe if I work around the corner very slowly, I can kind of climb on up there. Oh, it actually kind of... Never mind. Maybe a full donut there won't even work. I'm not sure yet. Uh, It actually might, but the truck has really wide, inconsistent donuts, at least so far. If I had more like platform to play with, I could probably actually see how the truck handles. Unfortunately, I'm on like Lego blocks and that's making it really, really hard to work with. I could pretty consistently make it to he... Oh, I think we did it. We did it! For such a simple concept, this is really actually a lot of fun. Pretty sure I can just do a nice wide donut into these. Just gotta kind of get used to the truck. I got more room to play with on this one though, so I like this better already. So we're gonna come through and grab those two. Not sure what's next. Can't see what's up here, which is really stressful. Okay, we're going down here for a sec. Just testing the ramp. Gonna go for that. Was there one more coin? Where? We oh, it's over here. I actually think I could probably do this one fairly easily now that I know where the other coin is. It's just kind of a shame because you can't see it till you're already at, like, at the end of the level. I'm trying to do this quickly and swing through this way, which probably just isn't going to work. So I'll give up on my dream of doing that. But we will hit hopefully the middle one there. I missed the coin. I'm not touching. I don't know how to get that. And I'm not ashamed to admit it. So this actually really isn't that bad. I like how this car, how tightly it turns. Now that I've dealt with the truck, we can deal with anything. So that's fine. We're going to cruise probably around you guys. Yeah, now that I'm getting used to the controls, really not so bad suddenly. Probably should have practiced before I started recording. Oh, I thought that was going to stop. wonder where we're going, though. So, okay. The physics don't really work on there. Like, that thing seems to move independently of me, I just realized. So, I'm going to have to be circling forward a little bit while also drinking lava. All right. Oh, I got to dodge the pillars, too, I just realized. Oh, and there's a coin there, and there's lava over there. I kind of really like this level, though. I don't know why, because this is a terribly hard level, but I'm enjoying this. So, Oh, there's a coin there I never even saw before. Oh, I got distracted looking at the coin. It's a lot of pressure at the beginning to try and get that one, then you gotta kind of circle around that head, which is really annoying. This part itself isn't really too bad, depending on what you get stuck on. I... might be in trouble. Yeah, I got one of the coins. Um... 
That's probably good enough. It took me 15 seconds. You can't really do that level super quick because you're waiting on the ramp anyways. Okay, this one, not too bad so far. Collect two coins and we got to make it up the narrow ramp, which is as easy as that. Then we're going to grab that one. Then we're going to go up this ramp. Then we're going to turn that around fairly quickly and go doink. The last level seemed impossible. This one was easy, or at least we managed it the first try. So that's not saying it's easy. I might have just gotten lucky. This is going to be hard. This is an evil level. I can already tell this is just a really, really frustrating level. So the first coin's nice and easy to get, but that kind of tricks you into thinking the rest of this is going to be easy. I could probably use that cactus to stop. I think that's why it's there. I just wish this turned maybe a touch sharper. So we're going to try the cactus theory. Oh, it does work. Okay, we can just hit the cactus and then stop. That actually makes this level miles easier, provided we can get up the first damn ramp. So we're up the ramp. We're going to dive into that. Maybe the first time I got a little bit lucky with how easy the cactus worked for us. We're going to try that again. Okay, the cactus may not work. I think I might have found a bit of a strategy for the beginning. Okay, we're going good. This is a really awkward angle to work at. I didn't realize that before. <laughs> we're in trouble again. Come on, climb your way up. So at the beginning, okay, I kind of forgot the strategy. But I was kind of using that wall like that to pivot me back the other way. And then I can focus on the cactus. So the beginning is pretty easy. That's like a routine at this point. That part's getting easier. This part, still not super great. Gotta work on that. I just realized at the end of this level, it asked me to either retry or level select. So I guess that means it wants me to try and get that last coin, which we should be able to do with a little bit of struggling. Oh, we could actually drop back down and do it all again. Is that a bad idea? That sounds like a really bad idea, but I am kind of full of bad ideas. Do we want to go for this? Oh, I don't know what I just did. I completely, like, turned my brain off for a second. Oh, I didn't realize I could do it that easy there. Speedrun strats. Okay, I got the coin. Now I just gotta do the course one more time. That should be perfectly easy. I've successfully completed it, like, six times. So, oh, I definitely screwed that up. You gotta turn before you start hitting that. Otherwise, you die. Coming up on the coin again. We got the coin. This could be it. Our big shot. Now I'm putting all the pressure on. I'm gonna screw this up so bad. Okay, so far so good. We got to turn a little bit early on this one. We could actually... <laughs> Never mind. Okay, so there is no level after that. Okay, I see how it works now. There's three worlds, probably with five levels each. So uh, I guess that's it. But we'll pretend I collected all the coins along the way. Amazingly frustrating game. 